Smoke was coming out of the top of the house, the sides of the windows, downstairs window. Harrison was the first to call 911 at around 956. Fire crews arrived about five minutes later. They found a lot heavier smoke inside. Uh, as the crews advanced the first hose line in, they found the victim that was in just inside the front door. Then they carried the body out, and his skin just looked like it was all melted off his body. His clothes were all burned to his body. And they laid him in the yard first and then put him on the cot. When they laid him in the yard, his arm was all up like this. It didn't move, and he didn't move. He just burned all pieces. The house at 336 Holly Hill Drive was scheduled to be sold only two hours later at noon. About three months ago, the man who lived there, Leslie J. Burns Jr., was notified that his foreclosed home would be sold. The master commissioner of the Fayette Circuit Court removed the home from the list so it could be reappraised due to the fire. Neighbors described Burns as a nice, usually quiet man. He used to grow vegetables and share with the neighbors, but he hasn't done that in quite a while. Years ago, when I don't remember how many years ago, he used to be an electrician. His dad was an electrician, and his one brother that lives here is an electrician. But I don't think he's worked in quite a while. It was bad enough he lived by himself and didn't seem to, I don't, didn't see very many people go over there. It, it's just shocking.